Why are you here? Came to apologize for kissing that whole I used her. Yeah, we're fooling around, bro. She's pregnant with my kid. At least I'm being honest about it. And then it. you got sick. Karma's a isn't that? Do you forgive me by now? No, yeah, that's all right. Now that I'm forgiven, I wanted to, I don't know, I'm stressed out, Susie. Why? I feel like shit. I feel like a little clout chaser fucking scumbag. I know how the video played out where Zane said I kissed him and Zane kissed me, first of all. He forced mm -hmm. that kiss on me and he filmed it. I kissed you, but you also kissed Zane that night and you kissed Dylan Francis. I didn't kiss Zane. That's why we fought and roll the tape. I literally don't remember. I was like, ew. Promised the fans 10,000 likes, we'll rob a fucking liquor store. Let's go rob a liquor store, Jeff. Come on, man. That's what you wanted, right? Yeah. Come on, man. You're right? right? What's the Jeff that I know? Let's rob that Where's fucking it? liquor yes, store. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> there we go. I only Let's got go. one gun, though. You can put this in your shirt and make it look like it's a gun. That'd be good. It'll just scare him. We got this one to put in his face and okay. scare him. All right, I like that face. There we and go, Jeff. The fucking register. Say it again. Oh, you fucking bag. Hey, you look good. You look good. The people want to see that their idols are not perfect. Okay. How long have you been cutting hair for? I started cutting hair when I was 14, when I was your age. I'm 21. So you got your start on Musical.ly. Yeah. Could you do on. one for us here today? Uh. Would you guys want to see him do one here yeah, today? No. Uh, do a Musical.ly? Yeah. Give a round of applause. Yeah, I could, I could do it. Yeah? yeah? So what are some of your goals and uh, ambitions? Is that how you say like my goals in life, like yeah. where I want to go. Yeah. Uh, I really, I really like doing music. Uh, music, please. So. You want to be no better music. How'd you get your start? How'd you get your start on the internet? I just told you. Look into the camera when you say. I just it. told you, Jeff. Not to repeat it. Vine, 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 Vine. A lot of these kids. Like that. A lot of these kids that are watching this are going to be 9, 10, There's not a lot 10 of kids years old. These videos. There's going to be 10 year olds watching this. Be a little nicer to them. They want to know how you got your start. You only get one chance to be on this show. You want a haircut again? Good luck. Good How'd luck. you get your start? Hey, what is this? Got you a little okay. lean, a little Hennessy. A little Hennessy? Some Xanaxes. Oh, wow, okay, okay. All right, nigga, that's all I'm telling a little flip flop. You put the Henny and the lean together, and they drink that. Shut up. There you go, drink it up. Just do one here, just do one. I don't want to be, I, I don't know how to You're playing a SoundCloud rapper, you need to take the drug. I don't know who's just a kid. Hey, this is what they do. I told you we're filming a show for the internet. You're supposed to be a rapper. All right, the truth is, I really wanted to have a haircut show where I bring in famous rappers and celebrities. I don't have any rapper friends. To be honest, I don't even know if I remember how to cut hair. It's yeah. been 10 years. Yo. Whoa, 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 dude. What the hell are you guys doing? What, yo, what are you doing, bro? bro? Take it easy. First of all, take it easy. We're doing we're doing some content together. If that said, kid wasn't here right now, bro. We're all in the same biz, you know. We know what we're doing. What here. biz is that? Being a scumbag way. friend. Look, we discussed this. We said we were gonna do what Jake and Logan did in 2017, and we're gonna blow it up. All right, don't. But don't really get physical in here right now. Ah! Come on, come on, get in the Woo! Yeah. Yeah. Put the money in the fucking bag. Come on, calm down, you What are guys. you, stupid? Put the money in the Family. fucking bag. Run the fuck up. Run the fuck up. You got anything you want to say? Don't believe everything on the internet, you guys. We're just actors. In Hollywood. In Hollywood. Oh, Perfect. Okay. All right, we, we got it, it, I think. Yeah. Oh, shit, man. What the fuck, man? You didn't tell me we were doing a YouTube video? I was going to quit this shit. I quit cutting hair. This was a stupid idea. Leave a comment if you want to see more of this. If I don't get any good comments on this, I'm done. About a month ago, and then all of a sudden, we fucking got a hundred thousand subscribers. So now I guess I'll keep doing it. I'm really grateful that you guys got me to a hundred thousand subscribers, and now I'm gonna continue making videos as long as you guys keep watching them. All right, guys, I'll see you next week.
you're acting now. Uh, yeah, I'm not trying to like you know it's fun and all. I love doing it, but like I'm not trying to still be 40, what 43, and still do YouTube videos like cutting hair. You know. I'm 28. 28. Let me ask you a couple questions. What is uh, what is your what is a couple of your regrets that you've done in life? What do you want to know? What did I jerk off on the internet? No, I didn't. Jesus Christ, man. I wish our original guest would have showed up. You know what we were supposed to have here before? Cameron Dallas. But he couldn't make it. Instead, we got a wannabe Cameron Dallas. Okay. Let's just get on with the haircut. Oh, okay. You ever have a white guy cut your hair? Honestly, no. This is my first time. Are you serious? White, yeah, like, really letting a white person cut my hair. So, like, I'm really trusting Jeff. Y'all understand, like, I'm really, you know, trusting Jeff to cut my hair. So I asked the people on Instagram to send in some questions for Zane because Zane and I have been hanging out a lot lately and we're becoming good friends. So this is not like a standard interview where I'm actually curious about the person because I already know a lot. So you guys helped me out and we're gonna answer some of your questions. Yeah. Why don't you tell them how you got your start? I re How'd you get your start? Vine. <laughs> What's your relationship to Mike? He's just there, you know? Is he like an uncle, like a big brother? You guys fool around a little from time to time? Mm -mm. No, not yet. Not, not yet. No, 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 not at all. You said what? not yet. No, you, you led me into no. it. You, <laughs> you fucking try to sink my ship? What are you fucking? You bring me as a wingman here. You're like I'm a your wingman. I did not. I brought you to make content. Why is everything got to have a sexual connotation? I'm sitting in the sun. I had a lady's finger up my fucking ass. You I had a fucking... me to do a burger no, review. No, it doesn't and matter because I look the... at you as a friend, as a friend, not a fucking pipe bomb. I'm sorry, I spit all on it. okay. I'm, I do want to also say this really quickly. I don't know how this affects anything, but I am standing on a dirty diaper. There's a, a shit filled oh, no, dirty diaper. You know what? We should do a review of. <laughs> Take a bite of that. Let's do this. 10 out of 10, baby. Yeah. <laughs> um, is that is that short enough for you? Uh, is it cool or do you want, would you like it a little more boyish? Is it too okay, like? Why do you always say that? Do you look too much like an adult man, or do you want to tone it down and put in like some fucking zigzag lines or some bullshit in the side? Mm, you're really pushing your limits here a little bit, buddy. Yeah. You know, calm down a little bit before I have to like whip your ass on camera or something like that. I sense a little animosity. At least we got a good title. Fuck boy haircut. Musically say that star. One more time. Ex musically star hits rock bottom. Addicted to drugs now. We're gonna do his beard lineup here. Make the beard feel a little more clean cut. Why don't you talk a little bit about your past while I'm lining up your beard? Okay. At a very young age, my dad and my mom split. There's no way that they're gonna work out together. You know, the religions, the way they view things, it would never work there. If you met my dad and my mom separately, well, you'll see what I mean. Okay, we just, we, we, we completely fucked up his beard. Are you serious? But that's because he was telling a story while I'm cutting your beard. You I'm, told me to you told me to talk about my How my am I gonna childhood. cut your beard with well, your chin moving around like that? Why don't you talk a little bit about your past while I'm lining up your beard? Okay. They're very kind inside. Burger's delicious. Brought us all closer together. What more can you ask for? Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. Okay, Jeff. I'm not surprised by your rating today. You've given the exact same fucking rating on every whatever. I mean, I think it's a ten out of ten. Nice. Both of you are just <laughs> no, disqualified for further review. What about the girl you FaceTimed? Anything, anything tan up over there? Yeah. No. Why don't you call her back? Just call her back and uh, and tell her that you have feelings for her. And then I'll let you call anybody in my phone. Hey. Hi. When do you get back to LA? Cause uh, I wanted to sit down and talk about some stuff. Like what? Just about me and you. Is it my final friend zone? Yeah, no, I was thinking maybe we can Talk about being more than just friends. I didn't ever want to be just friends. Look at me. Don't huh? look at me. Oh. Is this just like some elaborate prank? No. So just let me know whenever you get back and we'll talk about it, okay? Say you love me. Alright, well. What? I say I like you or uh, I love you. I lie you. I love you. And I'll see I you soon. Alright, bye. Thanks for you. Dude, you- I'm pretty sure she knew it was a No, prank. no, she didn't. You started laughing and you almost fucking really crushed her. I know you're only 16, but she's an adult and girls mature faster she's, than boys. She's younger than me. She is? Yes. No. She's 20. God dang, oh, dude. <laughs> no, I thought she was like my age, closer to my age. What, so 45? It's amazing what a haircut can do. It could 
save a, a, a drug addicted musically ex uh, star and get his career back and give him the confidence to ask out the girl of his dreams. Or it can give a 45 year old midlife crisis guy that films interviewing people on the internet a life and maybe build his career. You heard it here first. Whoa, you guys better not have smashed up that baby. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. no. They I can't work like this. Are you fucking serious? I've seen you act. Also, I didn't <laughs> sign up for this. No, just give me some fucking something I can work with. I'm stuck on YouTube. It's time for Meme of the Week, where we check out some of our favorite memes. Can you grab my laptop from my bedroom? I love memes. Right. This is my favorite. I love I a good meme. Yeah, so. Come on there. Oh, all right. That's it for Meme of the Week. Um, what else do we got planned for the show? Hey Siri, pull up some of the hottest new internet memes. Sorry, I can't find any results for I don't know why she does that every time. What is that that fell out? That fell out of your pocket? Huh? This fell out of your pocket? What is that? What is this? Drug use? Hmm? X musically star. No. Ad addicted to drugs. That's not mine. Get a thumbnail. That is not mine. What was that needle for? Uh, that was actually, I used to have a roommate that had diabetes, so it's an insulin needle. So you could take that home if you want. We give the, we give the guests gifts okay. here on the show. You could use it as a prop in your video, or okay. you could, you know, just show your friends. Um, how do you think I am at interviewing? Do you think I'm a good talk show host? Uh, I mean, it could be better. Yo, what the fuck? You dropped the baby! Oh my god, man, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry you had to deal with this piece of shit in your life, this fucking loser, drug addict. Go back to Connecticut where you drop babies every Go day. Go rehab, Mike. Why couldn't you guys do this when we were on scene? Why are you doing it now? Oh, insert this close up. Insert, it's like come a in. fucking movie. Cuts. And that's that's it. Rap scene, and then you start acting. What the fuck is going on, dude? Is that the vibe? Because that looks very unnatural. It looks. Just, un just give me you know what looks unnatural? Smashing a baby. Does anybody have the needle? I need it. Yeah, here you go. Wow, I never knew I could be such a fucking boy. What's in here, motherfucker? Wow. <laughs> Alright, so we'll go like this? No, don't post that. Did you just drop that baby? It was an accident. Ain't no accidents, pal. You're gonna pay for what you did to that baby. The dog. I tripped over the dog, man. No, but it's, so it's a dog's fault? It's a dog's fault? Steven, get, get this guy. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Get the face, get the face. Get the face. Get the face. Oh, oh, you fuck! This shit, I haven't cut hair in 10 years. Last time I cut hair, I was in prison.